Moe Quilt Shop is holding a quilt drive for those who have been affected by the fires. As KITV4's Ariel Argel reports, the businesses so far have been able to donate more than a thousand quilts. Marilyn Samashima owns the Maui Quilt Shop. She wanted to do something to help out her community after so many of her neighbors lost everything they had to the Lahaina wildfires. From the onset, it was a feeling of helplessness. And, you know, I donated what I could. I, you know, at the shelters, I did what I could. I still felt that I needed to do more to somehow give them some comfort. Just days after the fires, Samashima created the Aloha Quilts Donation Drive, asking people on Facebook to donate quilts to her shop. She, in turn, would donate quilts to the people who needed them most. Samashima says she's received nearly 1,600 quilts so far, and she's been able to give two-thirds of them to her fellow Maui residents. I really didn't expect this many quilts, but it's been successful as the um, Quilters from across the country have donated quilts. Selma Shima says she's received boxes from nearly all 50 states as more and more quilting companies and guilds find out about her quilt campaign through Facebook. I just feel like this is such a small thing that we're doing, but at the same time, too, I hope that when it, these quilts reach Maui, that people know that they are thought of and cared for and loved from far away. The Main Street Quilting Company is just one of many businesses from the U.S. mainland that's donated to the drive, providing more than 50 quilts and 80 pillowcases. We still have boxes to unload, and every day we're getting boxes. So we're not done with this yet. The quilt campaign will run until the end of September. However, if they still receive quotes after the drive ends, the quilts will still find a home among the people of Maui. To donate or receive a quilt, you can go to the store in Wailuku or you can find the shop's contact information on our website at KITV.com. Errol Argel, KITV4, Island News.